Hello, well here I am, believe it or not, at the top of Trinity Street, opposite Holy Trinity Church. And of course behind me you can see there's a great big hole has appeared. I'm here with my colleague councillor David Welsh. Tell me, what on earth is this great big hole all about? Well we've started excavations for the uh, installation of the new Coventry Cross. As we've done that we've discovered more about our history. We've uncovered uh, part of Butcher Row, which dates back to the 1300s. Now this is Trinity Street, this is obviously one of the oldest streets in Coventry. It happens quite a lot in Coventry. We start digging, we start finding old bits, old bits of Coventry. They found bits of pottery dating back just a few years, but also going back hundreds of years as well. Quite interesting. How are they going to preserve it? So they're going to document it, they're going to take pictures, they're going to uh, look at how they preserve it going forward. So to protect it, they, they're, they're going to be burying it again under Coventry Cross, but that helps protect it going forward. And of course, this is ultimately the location of where the promised uh, redeveloped cross is actually going mm. to go. That's right, isn't it? It is, yeah. And I think that's um, really positive because it's bringing back another piece of our history for people to enjoy. It's going back that's to the original location, which I think point. is really important. That's the point. Thank you. So here's the location for Coventry Cross, doing a bit of excavation work in the meantime, opposite Holy Trinity Church. It's on schedule to be ready to be seen uh, by the end of February, early spring next year. And of course, it will have, as part of it, this regenerated Coventry Cross, part of the original Coventry Cross, which was the King Henry the Sixth statue that we've completely 3D printed and will be back on show for members of the public. Coventry Cross on the way.